Hello, I'm Jeff Carter, head golf professional at Spring Run Golf Club. Today we're going to talk about local rules here at Spring Run Golf Club. USGA governs all play, but in the upcoming videos I will show you what our local rules here are at the club. Out of bounds here at Spring Run Golf Club is deemed by these white stakes. And they are on the inside lines of the white stakes would deem your ball out of bounds. Also, if your ball lands out of bounds on the road or any kind of bordering fence on the golf course, your ball will also be deemed out of bounds. All water hazards here at Spring Run Golf Club are lateral water hazards. It is Rule 26-1 in the USGA rule book, and they are deemed by these red lines and or stakes that we have here at Spring Run. We are on hole number 12. On this hole, there's an environmental sensitive area. We cannot enter this area at any time. We have to use the rule 26-1. It's a lateral hazard rule. We cannot enter the area. We cannot hit our ball from this area, and we'll have to take our options from there. Our next local rule is an immovable obstruction rule, and it really deals with sprinkler heads around the putting green. It is rule 24-2. As these three things must happen when taking relief. One, the sprinkler head must be at least two club lengths from the putting green. Two, my ball cannot be more than four club lengths away from the putting green. And three, if my ball has to be in direct line from the sprinkler head to my target or to the hole. To take relief, I'm going to have to use my next best point of where I can take relief. And I will show you that now. Here's the ball going directly in line. Here would be my next point of relief. I mark that with a T. I can take one club length, no closer to the hole. and then I can just drop the ball shoulder width. Now the ball is in play. This will enable you to even putt or chip the ball with the sprinkler head in the way. Our next local rule is the embedded ball rule through the green. You may take relief if your ball is embedded in the fairway or the rough, but you cannot take relief if your ball is embedded in the hazard as well as in the bunker. To take relief, just take the ball out. You may clean it. Your nearest point of relief, no closer to the hole, and drop it just as close as you can to, the, to your mark. Now the ball's in play. We have a couple local rules with our coquino pass and waste areas. First of all, if my ball is located in between both blue stakes from off the tee and close to the green, I must play the ball as it lies. And then I'll show you what to do if your ball is on a coquino cock path. We're still on the local rule of the coquino cart path. You notice my ball has landed right on the coquino car path that I am titled to relief under our local rule. The hole is located right here. We're on hole number five. I'm going to take my nearest point of relief where the ball would be. That would be my nearest point. And then I get one club length no near to the hole. Take my ball off the car path. I may uh, clean it as well. Arm out. Now the ball's in play. You can use this to your advantage here at Spring Run.
our next local rule, we're going to discuss the decorative flower areas that we have here throughout the golf course. We request that you do not hit from these areas. Take your closest point of relief. Take the ball out of the flower area. Your closest point of relief. Drop the ball. And now the ball is in play. Again, please do not hit from these areas. We have just finished showing you examples of the local rules that we have here at Spring Run Golf Club. You can find these local rules on the back of the scorecard as well as the website. And again, if you have any questions, please come into the golf shop and we'll be happy to discuss any local rule or the rules of golf with you.